All right, if you hate getting stuck at red lights, and this could be for you, a new app now being tested here in the Bay Area promises to help drivers avoid red lights and stay in what it is calling the green wave. KPXY's Jackie Ward shows us how it works. It sounds like a driver's dream, rarely hitting a red light or knowing the exact moment the signal will turn green. If you know you've got 45 seconds, you can turn and talk to the person next to you. Uh, or deal with your kids in the back seat who are squabbling. President and co-founder of the company Connected Signals says the Enlighten app takes live traffic signal information directly from a city's traffic management system. Before the light changes, the app sounds a chime which tells you to get ready to drive and stops the countdown so you don't use it as a racing start. After a lot of data analysis, its models then predict what the traffic signal will do. Some drivers are skeptical about it and fear it's yet another distraction for drivers. Like the whole Waze app and stuff, I don't even use that. I'm just going to get there when I get there. Going here for the navigation is distracting. That information is displayed through the app's speedometer, an image drivers are already used to seeing, lessening the risk of distraction, Etherton says. If we can predict more than one light ahead, then there will be an outer arc, an outer green arc, or an outer red arc. And if you keep the needle in, both greens, then you'll basically be in the green wave and you'll make the flow of lights down the street. Tech magazine Wired reports that Connected Signals only makes money by selling the collected data to car manufacturers and other data providers. BMW is building the app into its newer models. And other than driver satisfaction, Etherton says not hitting red lights is safer for everyone. Being told a speed which will get you to a light when it's green, actually, according to the U.S. Highway Administration, is likely to reduce collisions by about 25% at red lights. You have to opt in for the app to follow your every move and provide the data, but the app claims it keeps your information private. Right now, the app's only available in Walnut Creek and San Jose. In San Jose, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.